This is Keep On Pushing TV with Devin Harris. You know, it's not that I don't think there are differences in talent. Sometimes people ask me, like, do you think we're all equally talented? I don't think we're all equally anything, right? Every person is their own unique self. I can even think of just myself within my own personal experience. I can tell you I'm more talented at psychology than I am at, uh, you know, say history or mm -hmm. um, well, I can, there's a long list of things that I don't think I'm especially talented at. So it's not that I think we're all equally talented or that there's no such thing as intelligence. It's just that I do think there is a preoccupation um, with this. And I think maybe it's because it's pretty clear, you know, if you teach somebody for an hour and they pick things up super fast, Mm -hmm. You know, you get very excited as a teacher and you think like, wow, this kid is such a talent. Um, and 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 that is a great thing. But I, I guess the question will be, will, will they show up tomorrow? And what about next week? And then what if they have a really bad couple of, you know, games or, you know, recitals or, you know, like grades? You know, are they going to come back then the following year? And then will they be at this in 10 years? And it's not that you you are immoral if you don't have this kind of stamina. But I do think it's the nature of achievement that um, that it requires a kind of long-term orientation. I think when I was a teacher, which was um, in my 20s, I was a teacher in the New York City public schools and then in the San Francisco public schools. And I think what I saw was um, that talent wasn't enough. Um, I had very, very bright kids who I thought, oh, for sure, this kid's going to be at the top of the class at the end of the year, but turns out maybe not. And I also had kids for whom, like, you know, every every step in their progress was a really, you know, hard fought uh, step and and many times they surprised me. I don't want to say that grit is the only thing other than talent that you need. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's social intelligence and there's empathy and there's also um, a kind of like self discipline, which I think is a little bit different from from being passionate about what you're doing. Like, right. can you get yourself to do things that are kind of boring when you have to? So it's not just that I saw as a teacher that grit was the only thing that was different from talent, but I do think it made me. Um, realize that there's so much to a person's potential that is not contained in um, measures of early, early evidence of talent.